All right, everybody, second match of the night tonight was Goldust going up against uh, his brother, Stardust. We saw a big backstage sort of, uh, uh, you know, montage before this one, the uh, the breakup of the Rhodes brothers, uh, basically having Dusty and uh, Goldust meet in the back, basically just, you know, Dusty Rhodes talking to Dustin, uh, telling him, uh, basically, you know, just, just go in there and handle your business, uh, but know at the end of the day, this is your brother. And basically, you don't want to hurt him too much. And that is the story that they're weaving. And uh, it was basically Goldust going out there and saying that he was going to get in the ring tonight. And he was going to, you know, um, you know, wrestle Cody. And he was going to make sure that he beat him to the point where he didn't want to, uh, you know, uh, wear that face paint again. I don't know where they shot this, um, you know, this backstage promo or where they came up with the idea of it. But it seems that. That wasn't the match that they went out there and wrestled. I don't know if they, uh, they they did one promo and then they changed the match somewhere along the way because they they have a, a different way that this story is going. But uh, um, this was a very weird, a very dull um, match. It, it was almost like these guys really didn't feel each other out. You know, so many times when we see tag teams break up, uh, so many times we see you know these partners go into the ring and have singles matches. And they just have all sorts of chemistry because, you know, you watch this guy wrestle uh, night in and night out at house shows, Monday Night Raw, SmackDowns, pay-per-views. Uh, these guys went in the ring almost like they had never seen each other or didn't understand their style. Almost every move they messed up in the in the first couple of minutes of this match uh, to the point of where, you know, uh, they just tried to slow everything down to the point where Cody slash Stardust uh, was yelling at the fans for chanting Cody, Cody, Cody. Um... It seems that everyone out there wants the best for Cody Rhodes, um, you know, to go on in the career. I, I don't know many people who don't like Cody Rhodes. Uh, a lot of people think that he has a whole bunch of talent. I'm not going to say that people think that he's like the best pound-for-pound -pound wrestler in WWE uh, for his size, but I definitely think that he definitely should be in a spot bigger than where he is for now. Um, you know, it, it seems that this story isn't over. Uh, Goldust, you know, did score the victory via a roll-up, which did surprise me, basically with uh, Goldust saying that he was going to beat Cody to the point of uh, not wanting to put on that paint on anymore and that we would see Cody Rhodes once again. But, uh, you know, Goldust never beat on Cody. It was just a strictly wrestling match. Um, I did think it was really weird. Cody's attire out there as Stardust. Uh, you know, normally as Stardust, he wore the the, uh, the full-on, I don't know what to call it, a leotard or get-up, whatever you want to call the uh, the, the Stardust uh, outfit. Now he's just wearing long tights. Um, you know, he's, he's got a bare chest. Uh, he didn't paint his full face. He, you know, did the star, but then left the mouth and chin um, unpainted. So maybe it was like the unraveling of Cody. Maybe Cody's coming undone, uh, or, uh, you know, he's coming out of the Stardust. I mean, Maybe, I don't know, but um, um, as with all of these matches, you have to wonder, you know, what does this you know, mean to WrestleMania 31? I'm honestly going to go on to the point of saying that I hope this storyline gets raveled out faster than, you know, WrestleMania. I, I don't want to see this match again. This match didn't lead me to the point of anything of wanting to see this. I know that it is the, a dream of theirs, and I've been uh, on their side basically saying, you know, um, back since, like, 2010 when Goldust was, you know, on uh, Twitter, uh, basically, you know, just begging the fans for support of a, a Goldust DVD and uh, getting him a Goldust uh, versus Cody Rhodes as a retirement match at WrestleMania 26 or 27. And, um... I don't know. I know that this is what they really want. I know the Rhodes family means a lot to WWE. I know that Cody Rhodes has a bright future, I hope, in WWE. But I, th this isn't the match. I mean, Cody's gone out at WrestleMania and had great matches with, uh, you know, Rey Mysterio, Ted DiBiase, and Randy Orton. And, um... He had a match against Big Show. That was it. It was a match. But then again, it was Big Show out there with him. But uh, we're going to have to see. Uh, I'm not 100% sure where they go from here. But I'll just say I don't want to see this match again. It just wasn't for me.